All right, it's Thursday, so it's DIY time, and uh, we are continuing our project, which was the wine stand with two glass holders. So you could put your wine bottles on this side, and you could put your glass, your glasses in on this side. Uh, we'll put it this direction or this direction, actually, and uh, we'll connect it there. So my good friend Rokas over here is yes, here to sir. help me, but step back a little no bit. No problem. I do you have just tell me what you need me to do, and I, I'm here. I do have a little cutting to do. And, uh, you know, so where we last left off, we had put these together. So now I told you the other two pieces you need to cut, you need to uh, measure the piece there. So this actually measures at exactly 11 and a half inches. So you're going to cut two pieces at 11 and a half inches. And from there, we're going to move forward and uh, continue this project. And we're going to finish this today. So if you just step back slightly there, Rokas. Oh, you're going to cut now? Yeah, we're going to measure right. your piece here. This is a and one and a by six. This is a one by six um piece and I'm going to cut this to 11 and a half inches. Nice. Again, you want to measure just one uh, 16th of an inch extra because that's about how much your blade would take off. You're then going to take either a ruler or a speed square. In this case, I'm using a speed square. Draw a line. Such a weird name. It's called a speed square, but it looks like a triangle. I don't yeah, get it. I <laughs> <laughs> so as we continue here, All right. and uh, just that trick I learned, uh, I figured out the other day. So ensure that you are safe. I have my gloves. I have my glasses on today and you would definitely want to protect your eyes if you're going to use a power saw on this next side if you're going to use a power saw to cut anything right so you just line up your blade oh you're using the blade to help you so using the i'm using the speed square to help yeah. help guide me right go ahead all right so there we are we are so you, you go in line with your line that's where you draw the line for it's a guide and uh once you're there this speed square is actually slowing me down a little bit so there we go a little trick there, you put your squeeze piece square against the blade. So we're going to do the same thing one more time. I now understand why Fiola was requesting dust in your face. It now makes sense. <laughs> I understand now. Good job, Fiola. All right, so we're going to do the same thing. You're going to measure at 11 and a half inches plus 1 16th of an inch. So that by the time you cut, you're going to get exactly 11 and a half inches. Nice. I wonder how much is one sixteenth of an inch. There are markings on, on the tape, and one and stroke. And divided into sixteenths. Yes. Oh wow! Look how you learn something new every day. And as regular on all measuring tapes. Um, generally. This one? Generally. Okay. Nice. All right. If you do not have a speed square to use and uh, you want to cut it free-handed like this, you could just mark um, where your line is. Put your blade in. In place, uh, you want to back the blade away from the piece of lumber first. So it starts up and then so go So you start it. and then you go. All right. So now we have both of our two and So this is now just discarded wood? Um, no, you can use that for some other project. But that's what I mean, for this project. For this necessary. project, yeah, right. we don't I'm need to move it from the table. Right. All right. So now that that is cut, What's next? you can see that this goes here. Oh, it's gonna, a backing piece? Yeah, it's a backing, so we're going to back both sides. Okay. Um, so same thing, we're going to go with our... Pilot holes. Pilot holes, right, yeah, you remember? Boy. Quite well. I'm a, by, by the time I'm done with this shoe, I'm making things out here. <laughs> I'm out here to build. You, you build the nation. To, to do it yourself. I'm just going to speed things along a little bit and just uh, drill a pilot hole on this side at One once. Time. Yep. And yeah, then, Rockers, you could drive the screws in. All right. All right so sorry. now we're going to put in the screws. There we go. Same thing on the other side. Yeah, man. All right. Thankfully, we have pilot holes. All go. right. Back in intact. Alright, we're gonna put the other piece oh, of back in there. Oh, we have to there. double back in. Back in by two. Is our back in track? <laughs> sorry, I wouldn't, that I wouldn't get really that That was really stale, one. guys. I'm so sorry. That was a DJ joke of some sort. No, it was just a bad joke. <laughs> it was just a poor, poor joke. All right, so pilot holes again. Pilot holes again. Followed by. It's a wine rack. It's a wine stand. A wine stand. Okay. And we're going to put in those glass holders that we um, cut last week. All right. I'm pretty sure that's not how it's supposed to sound. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And now we're going to do our two final pieces. So essentially, I would have liked to use glue 
to uh you know try to, to avoid some of the um things but what we're gonna do here uh no you have your piece this is a one by six piece and it's cut to um just a few inches i could measure it again but um you know in the essence of time so what you want to do is attach pilot hole? uh yeah we're gonna have to right. use yeah, a pilot i'll hold, hole. I'll hold a new pilot hole all right all sounds right. good Teamwork making, teamwork makes making the it, dream work. You know, when they say do it yourself, they really mean you need help, huh? Like most times, you need an extra <laughs> pair of hands. You need somebody to help you. Like, Sorry to it. turn my back on you guys, but I do need to do that to get this angle right here. And we're going to go center. Nice. So my pilot hole is drilled, and since you're holding there, I'll yeah, drive in. Screw, screw one time. All right. And once, if you want to just line it back up with the exactly as, as you had it before. I think this is how I had it. All right. So that's one side in. And now we're going to do the same for the other side. And we'd be pretty much done. And then, of course, you could do all the nice beautification uh, process. Is this that one screw is going to hold it properly? Yeah, that, that will hold it. Because uh, something for very... full glass of wine? So now... No, no, no. Uh, an empty glass is, is hung here. No, if down. I like, man, and I want to put my glass here well, to I mean, chill, you, you why can, not? You can rest your glass on it. That'd be no problem. You sure? Yeah. All right. There we go. Next one. Right. So this, we're going to do the same. I'll come so and hold. Come and hold, and I will grab this drill first. Just hold that right in place. And we're going to drill yes, a pilot wait, hole. Wait, 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 wait. All right. Go ahead. Pilot All hole right. time. Pilot hole time. Now, if you wanted to put, if you're more comfortable putting two screws, you could. And it's in the second piece there. So now it's about time. I'm not even going to unmove it. I'm not going to unmove it just in case. Just in case. See? You are the best assistant with this ever. That's why... Ever these, you say, no? Ever. That's why these... <laughs> that's why these DIY projects are coming out so good. Because I have good help. And there we go. You can let go. That's it? All right, so done there? then you could just do the beautification process. You oh, know, when you, you say beautification, you mean like varnish it? You or? sand it down and, okay. and, and, and you know, uh, varnish it We need a wine after. glass. Where's what going on with this? And, and we need two wine bottles because yeah. two wine bottles could fit in here. I feel like and we need to get two things two glasses in order. on Hurry. this side. Better preparation next time. <laughs> 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 but well done. I mean, so let's take a, a gander. Take a, a quick gander. So All you know, right. you could put take this a on a tabletop. So you see the inside? Right, you see the inside of it here? And okay, so you put in your wine bottles to stand up. That's right. And uh, then you have this part that's, that you can hang it. What's this thing here? It's like, it's like yeah, yeah, part yeah, of the I, yeah, I have, I have to trim that and okay, stuff. Okay, all right. No so you, you just stick in the glasses here, so the stem goes here, and you rest down the. Where's called that part? The um, the cup. The yeah, the 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 coop. The coop. Yeah, coop. Yeah, it's actually yeah, the the coop of it. <laughs> I feel like you're just making this up. No, no, no. I, I, I studied wine. I know, I know. Okay. All right. Okay. <laughs> so, right. So, you're putting the bottles in here. You put your, your glass in there. And you could put that down on top of the table. You could put it down on you the side. You could put it on table. You know, if you want to go a little bit further. And uh, you could actually drill a hole through here and attach this to a wall if you wanted to. Oh, that's a good and, idea. Um, yeah, you know, so you could have it hung up on the wall and you yeah. could have your, your glass. Well, this And way. you could paint it down <laughs> to match your living room or to be a standout piece or a kitchen or wherever you're putting it. Yeah. And, well uh, done. So, so now you've seen. Who on this is? Well, you see, Lisa was here last week when we started. But she's not here today. She's not here today. But it's not done. It's not done today. I, I mean, I could beautify it as part of my do it myself. <laughs> but I'm just saying, you know. Hi, Lisa. Morning. <laughs> <laughs> but well done, Gary. Well done. Oh, well yes. done. Yeah, thank you Good for job. the help, my friend. Yeah, thank man. You. No problem. I feel like as I helped, you know, it should be part mine. But I'm not getting into that mm. conversation because Lisa <laughs> will have my head. <laughs> so, ladies and gentlemen, I want to thank you all for watching um, DIY Another today. Another segment of DIY on a Thursday with, with your boy, me. But you, wow. <laughs> Let's take a break and come back with some more with your boy, him. <laughs> <laughs>